Do you guys know what uh, the Mott and Bailey fallacy is? No, explain it to the audience. I mean, I think I've heard of it, but... The Mott and Bailey Castle is an early medieval fortification where there's like a very protected area, the keep or the mott, and then the bailey is kind of this looser area that's harder to defend, right? So what happens is if they need to retreat, they'll go into yeah. the mott. So this has become known as a debating trick or fallacy where people will make a really outrageous claim, which is they'll, they'll basically run to the bailey, and then when you prove that it's false, they'll run back into the mott and say something very unobjectionable. So in the context of like the AI job loss fallacy, the Bailey is people will say, this is causing massive job loss, massive disruption. It's already here, you can see it. And then when I point out, well, actually, if you look at the Yale Budget Lab study, or you look now at the Vanguard study, there is no job loss, then they'll retreat into the Mott and they'll say, no, 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 I'm talking about what's gonna happen in the future, which is a position that's fundamentally irrefutable. And I just want people to be straight about it or honest about it, which is, look, if your claim is that this will cause job loss in the future, it's true. I can't refute that because none of us can prove what's going to happen in the future.